the real exploring part three. <gasps> and since my last one was so boring, I am going to try my very best to make this one not boring. All right, let's get into the video. So for this video, we're gonna go a little bit far, but we have been going that way, from this way to that way, the entire time exploring this place. So I think this time we could go that way and see if there's anything that's interesting over here. No, we can't go in here, but I can tell that there was a path dog. It has something to do with the water over there, so we're gonna keep on going. Again, skip to whatever if you want to miss this, but I'm going to see if I can catch anything at the corner of my eye again. I see a big hole over there, so I'm gonna go over there. Oh. Uh. What? This tree took critical damage to something I am terrified of. Oh my god. No, I'm not, I'm not set for the tree. The tree's still standing, but. I'm just scared if I can do this to a tree. That's what I can do to a human. Oh my god, I am terrified now. I'm still gonna go. It's all for the purpose of your content and entertainment. Oh, I actually think I found the real beginning. Good thing I actually came to this area because it looks like, yeah, over there. Mm, all right. Oh yeah, I definitely have to get the end. There is more pipes. Does this come from the school? Is the school doing this? I don't know if you can see that black pipe. But there's another pipe over there. I don't know if you can see it, but there's another pipe. All right, we can't go much far because we can't go much further because I have to stay in the park area. made a shocking discovery i think after like more parts because even though this is part three we had a part zero so remember four parts i think we have finally figured it out well what are we gonna do now this video was originally about me just hugging trees and being a tree hugger so reminded me of that incident we found i hope i don't see it while i'm walking back Oh yeah, we passed the tree. I can just see the tree, but the things are like hidden in the grass. So if you weren't looking down, you wouldn't have been able to see it. So
So, I'm going to try to record for about three minutes. But, but what would the school be leaking out water? If we, if we all believe that that is where this water is coming from, then why, why is the school throwing away water? Especially with their multiple stalls, their multiple drinks for water, multiple refills, multiple people are washing hands in classrooms and in multiple bathrooms placed all around the school which all have multiple stalls of toilets with toilet water just why would they be throwing away water are they throwing away non-filtered water no that'd be useful for, for our bathrooms hmm. I don't know. Is this just natural? Has somebody built pipes that were actually physically functional, which like people, I think most people think this, that are fully functional and then it got destroyed. More school buses. It got destroyed, leaving back some water that was still running. But where, what, why is the water still running today? I don't know. If we think that somebody is constantly drying away water, like the school we think all this water is coming from, then, oh. I don't know. That's one question I will never, I don't think we can ever know the answer from, unless somebody, one of you beautiful people, my beautiful people, will ever find out, will ever know the answer. So. Unless you guys dig into this. Why is there people at my school playing volleyball? I'm very confused. But um, maybe I'll try to get into this tomorrow, but I don't know. Well, I got some mystery, some mystery, but. That's the, about the end of this video. I'm Claire. Bye, 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 my beautiful people.